Hi all, welcome again. Like, share and subscribe for more videos. This time we will see how to find the square root of perfect square numbers in mind calculation. To find the square root, we have to know the squares of all the single digit number 1 to 9. With this, we can calculate the square root of perfect square numbers, 4 digit numbers easily. So this is the square of 1 digit number from 1 to 9. Last digit of the square root of perfect squares are calculated with the numbers 1, 4, 5, 6, 9. Why? Because if you see the last digit of the resultant of the square of all one digit number ends with 1, 4, 5, 6 and 9. Now let us see how the last digit of the number ends with 1 will be calculated. If the number is 1, that is the, the last digit of the number is 1, the last digit will be 1 or 9 because the last digit of the square of the number 1 and 9 ends with 1. The same logic if the number ends with 4, the last digit of the resultant of square root will be 2 or 8 because the last digit of the square of the number 2 and 8 ends with 4. If it is 5, the last digit of the square root will be 5. This way for the number which ends with 6, the last digit will be 4 or 6. Similarly for 9, 3 or 7. Find the square root of the number 6241. Here the number ends with 1. So the last digit will be either 1 or 9. Now let's calculate the first digit of the resultant. Let's take the first two digit of the number 6241 that is 62. Here 62 is less than 8 square that is 64 and greater than 7 square 49. So we have to take the number 7 as the first digit. After that we have to multiply the 7 with the next number 8 and which will give the answer 56. Now we have to compare this 56 with 62. 62 is greater than 56. So the last digit of the number will be the greater number that is 9. So answer will be 79. Now let us find the square root of the number. 1024. Here the number ends with 4. So the last digit of the resultant will be 2 or 8. Now let's calculate the first digit of the resultant. Let's take the first two digit of the number 1024 that is 10. Here 10 is greater than 3 square 9 and lesser than 4 square 16. So the first digit will be 3. After that we have to multiply 3 with its next number 4 which gives the resultant 12. 10 is lesser than 12, so the last digit will be the lesser number that is 2. So the answer is 32. Let's calculate the square root of the number 1849. Here the number ends with 9. So the last digit will be 3 or 7. Now let's calculate the first digit of the resultant. Let's take the first two digit of the number 1849 that is 18. Here 18 is greater than 4 square 16 lesser than 5 square 25. So we have to take the first digit as 4. After that we have to multiply 4 with its next number which gives the answer 20. 18 is lesser than 20. So the last digit will be the lesser number that is 3. So the answer is 43. Thanks for watching.